and I'll show you side by side how my hair looked before. And this was after the quick refresh. It took me less than five minutes to do. So my hair, as it gets bigger and thicker, it gets heavy on my head. So I always like to use lightweight products or less products so that it doesn't give me a headache but going without a curl cream was obviously a bad idea because <laughs> now it's all so frizzy so that is why I instead of washing my hair again I just want to refresh so in a refresh you don't have to wash your hair you just apply some product to bring the curls back so that's what I'm going to do today and I'm going to use the Trilux gel. It's called the High Definition Curl Enhancing Gel. So if you are looking to enhance your curls, so enhance as in to make better whatever is already there, then you go for curl enhancing products. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to apply this gel directly on my dry hair. So there's no water. So you can also call this no water refresh. But that wouldn't be true because one of the highest ingredients, like the first ingredients in this gel is water. So we're going to get the water from the gel directly. So I'm going to go section by section and I'm just going to work it like this because I already have some shape, but I want to enhance that except for the grays. The grays have lost everything. So they'll probably finger coil this part. But for the rest of the hair, now this section. Now this is called a spot refresh. I mean, you can call it whatever you want. You can also call it gel refresh because you're going to use a gel. I, mean, I call it spot because it's just, you know, you're going and enhancing the spots that you need. Enhancing. Smooth it over. So I'm just like roping each section and then just spraying hands in it till I don't feel the gel in my hands anymore. So you can see it's slowly starting to curl up. Okay, now let's do the other side. See, just roping it and roping it just to refresh. Like I don't want to be washing my hair again. So after roping each section, praying hands in it. See, you can see now the curls slowly coming back to life. Now to deal with my grey hair, so a whole new ball game, ball game, this grey hair. The rest of my hair is okay, but these grey, grey pieces need a little bit more manipulation. Okay, now I can air dry it and just leave it like this, but that could potentially have this risk where it can become stringy a little bit. So that's why I'm just, just one last gel before I'm going to diffuse my hair. So diffusing will set my hair immediately. So that stringiness won't happen. So you can attempt this refresh, but don't attempt this if you don't have a diffuser. Low heat and low speed. happening wow how long that it took like 10 minutes less than 10 minutes and i was going at it so slowly all right that's it so this was my spot refresh so i started off uh, with my hair that was i mean you you could see the curls but they weren't as defined as you see them now and they're probably like, they appear to be frizzy because of the light. This is, this was a bad idea. Maybe next time I'll sit in a better place. But what I did was I just applied a curl enhancing gel. So if you want enhancing, so and en what does enhancing mean? It, it's like making something that's good better. So my curls were already there, but applying the, a little bit of gel, just a tiny bit without any manipulation like that I didn't use any brush I just smoothed it over and I diffused and now it's back 
Yeah. See, you can you can see the whatever curls that were there, they're so much better now. Right after I used the gel and I diffused. So yay, yeah, this was my refresh. So, okay. Thank you for watching and subscribe if you like my video. This was the spot refresh. And I'll show you side by side how my hair looked before. And this was after the quick refresh. It took me less than five minutes to do. And now I'm ready to go. <laughs> See you in the next video.